Okay, children, we are live. We are in for a relaxing evening of watering watering our summertime crops here on Weed Farm 420 Farm. <laughs> and yeah, we're getting started a little bit late, but you know, it's uh it's me, so if you guys are surprised, you're not you're not real fans. <laughs> It was, in fact, a test of your loyalty. I really need to learn how to change my clothes in this game because I feel like I'm being held back by this Daria look that I'm serving here. Um, I don't know. I just don't know that this is me at my most confident. We're, we're, we're going to work on that. But first, I just want to get back into the swing of things. It's been 10 days since I've played... And I can't think of a better way to get... I'm really looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to, um, well, you know, just getting right back into filling up the watering can. <laughs> just get in there. Okay. How are you guys doing? How's, how's the chat? Thanks, Raven. <laughs> Welcome back. I've... Uh, yeah, I've, 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 it's been like ten, it's been a while since I sh I streamed. Um, I I did get a refund for my lack of shrimp. Yes, <laughs> I I went to New York New York City for a week just to, to meet up with some people and hang out. I'm trying really hard to um I'm trying really hard to not be a miserable depressed sack of shit. It's it's really a kind of hard. Um, but I am trying. Thank you, Bluebird. Um, it, I just, I don't know. Lately, I find it really difficult to, like, do basic shit. Like, respond to texts and talk to people. I guess it's depression, right? That's what, that's what that is, right? It's depression. <laughs> when, when you can't, when it's, like, it's, like, the hardest thing in the world to send one text message. The hardest thing in the world to do anything, really. It's depression. But I'm trying. I'm I'm trying to to you know what I mean. I'm trying. Thanks, Hig. Glad you liked it. I hope your mom liked it. Okay, picking tomatoes. Thanks. Uh, thanks, freelancer. I actually I went to Sichuan Mountain House. I was there, uh, just a few days ago. Actually, <laughs> it was extremely good. Yes, I actually had. I brought some leftovers home with me, and so I've been kind of snacking on a, uh, that like. Such one that you know that that dish that's like frog soup with a like bullfrog meat and lots of peppercorns. It's yummy if you're into that sort of thing, which I am. I, I guess I'm in a, what people here would consider an adventurous eater. Got a lot of peppers. Today's harvest. Our f Please don't tell me that frogs are one of the like the internet's sacred animals, like octopus that you're not allowed to eat. <laughs> yes, eating frogs is not that weird. People all over the world do it. Thanks, Jackson. Yeah, it is a. I guess it is a collective experience. Like, I, I really, I'm trying. I don't. I, the temptation is like to blame COVID, right? To be like, that's why I'm miserable all the time. Thanks, Blake. Um, and I think like it kind of is COVID, but I'm trying not to let that be like an excuse to just never feel happy again. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because, uh, thanks, Trampan. Yeah, I, I I feel like it is easy to kind of just be like, well, COVID, I'll never be happy again. There's no reason to even try. You know what I mean? I, I find those thoughts coming up a lot. Uh, thanks, Isaiah. You can't hear the game at all? You're just not mentioning this? Okay, hold on a second. Let me, let me, let me figure out OBS. See, I should have started even later. Then I could have, I could have tested it. Yeah, you're right. You can hear, you hear nothing. 
that's embarrassing. You haven't even gotten to hear the water sounds that I've been sitting here talking about. Uh, okay. Uh, is that it? Okay, yeah, that should be it. Save. Okay, what about now? Can you hear? Thanks, Oklahoma. I can sorry, I can't I can't read fast enough. Uh come to Japan. Yeah, I would love to come to Japan. I like come to Japan and eat weird stuff. Yeah, eating weird stuff is one of my favorite activities. Okay, you got sound. Woo. Okay. I'm gonna do some more watering can refilling just to make it up to you. Thanks, Eleanor. Okay, I think our crops are watered. We've even sold some stuff. It's it's time to, to get on with our day. Well, that's a lot of watering. I kind of, I do like the music, but I really miss the spring music. I already, I haven't, been, I've, I've been playing this game like two weeks and I'm already like super nostalgic about the spring music. Thanks, Christopher. Okay, what am I doing? I'm like, I feel like I need a, I need a plan here. We could, we could go, we could mine, we could seduce, we could, I guess the title of this stream is supposed to be seduction. But I, I, I kind of meant that ironically, like like with my last with my master class on horticultural science, I assume that we kind of all know that that's not a thing. Um, <laughs> put on Outlast music, yeah. I could finish Doki Doki. Does anyone like grapes? See, the chat's all saying seduce. Okay, we could do that. I feel like the the main trick to seduction in this game is looking up on the Stardew wiki what people like. So we should decide who we're seducing. Okay, hold on. I'm 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 using my phone to look up Stardew wiki because. Okay. Okay, not items. Gameplay. Villagers. Okay. Marriage candidates. Okay. Bachelors, bachelorettes. Okay. So there's really six options. <laughs> um, Abigail, Emily, H Haley, Leah, Maru, or Penny. Um, let's, let's figure out what they like. Okay, so Haley... Likes coconuts, fruit salads, pink cake, and sunflowers. I'm taking pictures of each of these. <laughs> you have to act like. See, the seduction of this game. This game. The, the stream is actually titled. Thank you, Alice. The stream is actually titled correctly because seduction in this game is kind of an inherently creepy activity. There's a journal. You're jotting down notes. It's creepy. It's weird. Okay, Abigail likes fucking everything. No, she likes she likes spicy eel. Ooh. Speaking of Sichuan food. Okay, Emily likes uh gems, basically. Okay. High maintenance queen. Leia likes food, okay. Maru. Uh, Maru's a, a weirdo who likes radioactive things and also <laughs> minerals. Uh, thanks, Mike. Uh, thanks, Left. Oh, yeah, I know people, people are getting very upset about me not being more zoomed out. Okay, I'll try zooming out a little more since people keep mentioning it. Penny likes a strange mix of things. Okay. 
You can make Tom Koss soup in this game? Well, it's very specific. Uh, thanks, Zachary. Okay. Zooming out. Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> uh. Okay. Does that make you guys happier? <laughs> Oh yeah, I should have paused the game. Well, okay, Jody. Jody's married. Dang. See, I feel like I don't have any good gifts, uh, so I should I should I need to go mine. Yeah, but it's kind of late. Well, we can go on a, a a last minute trip to the mines. The good uh, solid Saturday evening plan as a, a solid a commemorative 9/11 mining journey. <laughs> I don't know why you guys get so worked up with the size of the UI. It's a lot of like slightly neurotic behavior in the chat. I'm sorry, I've got to say. You guys get very worried about me doing things the exact right way. It's a stream about about turnips. It's a game about turnips, guys. It's it's okay. It's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be fine. I know we're all kind of on edge right now. Oh god, it's already nighttime. <laughs> Thanks, Skylark. Yeah, the, the, the Haley was the high maintenance diva. That that's the plan. That's correct. Uh thanks, go girl. My drink today is sake. Which I'm just drinking a big old wine glass of. <laughs> uh, okay, it's already nighttime. This is a little concerning. I feel like this is gonna lead to passing out. Wait, what? Okay. <sighs> What's going on here? What? Oh, it's like a rune stone or something that I can't read. No, Star Star doesn't have turnips. It's, is it parsnips? Is that what I'm thinking of? What I keep saying turnip. Okay. Where is um? I'm not good at finding things. This is the railroad, but is this is it's also the the mine cart maybe. Where's the adventuring club? I know I should use the map. <laughs> oh, I'm not even close, am I? Okay, I think we should go to bed before this gets out of out of control. Maybe I can find some good things on my way home. Like fiber. <laughs> Great. Um I do like the nighttime bird sounds. They're kind of eerie but in a comforting way. Thanks, Mark. Uh heads. Is it heads or tails? Okay, I got a geode. That's good because we can get the blacksmith to open geodes. And then we can get minerals out of the geodes. And then we can give minerals to babes. That's the plan. That's Secrets of Seduction. Country style. 9 11 edition. Okay. Wood and stone we can use to build to build things. Ah, who's the carpenter again? It's a Jody. It's too bad about Jody being married. It's really uh really kind of unfortunate. Thank you, Flavio. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um okay, how do I get out of here? Looking at the map. Not the way I'm going. <laughs> um, but yeah, Robin, not Jody.
Back to the vaping. <laughs> Okay, we're actually a little bit low on energy. Keep an eye on that. <laughs> okay, it's getting late. Okay, okay. Wait, I'm on my own farm. Oh. Secret traffic seduction. Secret pastoral. Yeah. Well, I think most sapphic seduction is pastoral in one way or another. It's kind of a inherently pastoral activity. Uh, meow. Oh yeah, I need, to I need to water the kitty. Water the kitty bowl. Wait, where's the... Me? Okay, here we go. Good night. We're making money. We're we're making we're turning serious profits here. Oh, thank you, Jacqueline. Thank you. Um, how many days are in a, a season? I guess at twenty. Okay, look how much money I have. I've never been richer. What are we doing with it though? Meow. <laughs> That's the you you have to meow at a cat every time a cat meows at you. That's the rule, right? We are making money moves. Okay. Oh, we got melon. Okay. No one particularly likes summer spangles, right? Mm. I bet Abigail likes driftwood. Seems like an Abigail kind of behavior. Oh, it's 20, okay, 28 days in a season. Thank you. Okay, should we go seduce Abigail with Driftwood? <laughs> I feel like we can... I feel like that's just the path of least resistance though, which doesn't appeal to me. <laughs> I like to make things difficult for myself, if you hadn't noticed. Glad you like my book spiral. This is a pickable flower. Yes, it's a sweet pea. It's... Wait, Haley likes driftwood? Are you kidding me? Okay, I gotta I gotta look at my my creepy notes. <laughs> my creepy seduction notes. <laughs> Haley doesn't like driftwood, she likes coconuts. Should we go on a coconut hunt? Yeah, we should go uh Thanks, Mark. I hope you're enjoying it. Thanks, Ay thanks Ayala. Ayala, sorry. Uh, have I listened to Lingua Ignota? Yes, I, I have. And people compare us a lot. <laughs> Which, I guess I kind of see as like a semi-similar aesthetic. Okay. I'm just gonna ignore the chat for a while because you guys are being useless. I'm gonna I'm gonna do some fishing. <laughs> I'm gonna do some valuable fishing since you, you'll you'll remember I'm so good at this. Okay, fishing is all about patience. Ugh. I don't have patience. <laughs> yeah, I would assume that uh, that coconuts come from from. Okay, I'm not fast enough. My my reflexes are clearly clearly wanting. Let's go find a beach and some palm trees. 
Wait, am I at the beach now? Where's the palm trees? Hi. Oh, you can just, yeah, like rustle trees. And... I should be doing that more, shouldn't I? Oh, oops. <laughs> There's the beach. Okay, look at all the great stuff you can find on the beach. Thanks, Alexander. Uh, should you finally watch Neon Genesis? People always tell me to watch that. I never have. So, you sure. <laughs> or you could just watch me forge for coconuts. Only you can decide how you want to spend the final minutes of your 9-11. Oh, there's a flower. No, yeah, I can't get through it. Now this is the wizard. Wizards don't- the wizard doesn't just do anything useful, does he? I have to fix the bus? Okay. Well. Wow. See, I have to learn everything the hard way. And by the hard way, I mean from the chat. Thank you, Derek. Um, no. How to win friends. Is my journal trying to tell me something? Okay. I'm trying. I'm trying to make friends. <laughs> it's hard when you're a depressed YouTuber, okay? It's hard when you look like Daria. <laughs> Purple hair Daria. <laughs> uh, am I- is this my farm? Things are getting a little overgrown here, aren't they? What? Thanks, James. I feel like I should be cutting these trees down because they're kind of annoying. Yeah, bribe people to get friends. I mean, that is kind of what I do in real life. I buy people dinner so I make friends. It works pretty well. People like dinner, you know? You know what people are like. They like to eat. Thanks, Eleanor. Congrats and good luck. <laughs> well, I'm trying to keep the big, the little trees from getting out of control. But can I not chop a whole fucking tree down? I don't think... Maybe I can. Oh my god, I can. I guess I should be chopping trees, huh? Oh, sap. Great. Oh, I guess I, sh I, guess I should be chopping trees because then I can plant more sh shit. It's also very satisfying. <laughs> when a tree goes down, don't you think? <laughs> These sounds. The sounds are everything. Yeah, this is my new career as a lumberjack. <laughs> oh, listen to those sounds. It's so good. They're rivaled only by the watering can. Wait, did I not get wood from the tree? I'm starting to feel exhausted. Oh shit, let's eat some grapes. Yes. Wait, that didn't... <laughs> give me a, a tiny amount of energy. Okay. Alright, well let's collect our stuff for the day. I'm 
pretty sure I got it. You guys need to relax a little bit. Okay, um, should I eat bug meat? No. I could eat the flower now. Go get the Abigail driftwood, I guess. Oh wait, no, I was supposed to go mining. I guess I could still go mining. If I can uh No, I don't have enough energy for mining. Who am I kidding? Well let's give people something. Like let's I got a lot of stuff lying around. Let's ha let's let's distribute it to the people to to win to make friends and influence people or whatever the th let's go to the let's go to the saloon that's what that's what we should do thanks lady uh <laughs> well if you're gonna date my, if you're if, if you're gonna date a philosophy PhD my advice is. You have to have a rule that you're allowed to shut down philosophical conversation at any moment. So you need a safe word, I would say, for, for philosophy. Thanks, Ben. You're very welcome. Join the club. <laughs> it's Leia. This sounds good. Uh, do I have anything spicy? Not really. I have sweet pea. Maybe she wants- maybe she'll like that. We'll try it. Oh. Okay, I'm already... <laughs> my journal is warning me against coming on a little too strong. Cam is not eligible, is she? Wait, there's Emily, but I don't have anything good to give Emily. Do I? What is Emily like? Oh, let me check my creepy notes. <laughs> okay. Amethyst, aquamarine, cloth, emerald, jade, ruby, survival burger, topaz, wool. Okay, I don't have any of those things. Well... What about sweet peas? Okay, well, she's feeling a positive energy. I'll, I'm, I'm gonna take that as a W. Um, get out of my way. Get out of my way, I'm trying to seduce babes. Move. <laughs> Abigail, there you are. I was just looking for you because I haven't finished wood for you. Uh, oh god. The desperation. The desperation of it all. I do like this. I like this blue couch. Should I get some Jojo Cola? No. Thanks, Fab. Thanks, Fab Zakin. Thank you for for teaching me pronunciation. When I'm like a little bit, a little bit. Whoa. What is this? Okay. Okay, I'm playing it. The game within a game, guys. This is... Oh god. I've... I've lost the game within the game. Okay. Oh fuck. This is like... Ah. Uh. Oh god. <laughs> this is a stressful game. Are you kidding me? This is... No, I can't. This is too much. We're playing Sturdy Valley because we don't want to be stressed. And whatever game that was is not conducive. Can we talk about the vibes of being in this balloon next to the fire with the rain outside? I'm gonna sit here. I wish I had a drink like this guy. I could sit here. I'm just gonna drink this drink. I'm gonna <laughs> just gonna drink my real drink and imagine that I'm in this balloon. People like coffee as a gift. Where do, we, where do you get coffee? Can you get coffee at the bar at the saloon? Safe. 
Oh, it's 10 p.m. Let's uh, give Driftwood to Leia. Where's Leia? Leia, I want to give you. I want to give you a stick I found on the beach. <laughs> I feel like I have. I feel like I have to marry Huey because after the potato incident, I don't think we can. I don't think I can move on from that. I think it's it's gonna stick with me until <laughs> I'm never moving on, you know. And we just have to hope that Haley's moving on. I feel like um, like it could be interpreted as negging the Haley incident. Oops, I just watered my. Cat. <laughs> I just watered the cat. Well, she didn't seem to mind. Okay, let's go to sleep. Kitty. Cattily. Cattily too. Please move. Oh no. Wait, I've been trapped out of my... I've been... The, the cat has taken him from my bed. This is a very realistic. Guys, what do we do? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fall... I'm gonna pass out in my house because the cat won't move. Cat, it's time to go. I know it's getting late. I can't sleep because the cat's in the... Ah, okay, problem solved. <laughs> yes. Look at it, look at it, it's gold, I'm... I am a rich man, <laughs> to quote Cher. It's, I don't, I don't need a rich man, I am a rich man. Well, look at me, I've got 20, 2,700 gold. Okay, and I got a letter. Exciting, exciting stuff. Hey kid, throat's about as dry as a desert bone. I'm real thirsty for a pale ale. You got one? Regular old beer won't do, I need a pale ale. Okay. Okay, Pam. I'll accept your alcoholic quest. <laughs> uh, these are ready. Oh, blueberries. That's... I love that. No, don't eat. We're selling these. Whoa, this is like... Look how many you get. No. Thanks, Ed. Guys, I have so many blueberries. Okay, hold on. Let's put let's put them in the crate before it's too late. Okay, and we got grapes. Oh my god, this is like this is a plentiful harvest. Oh shit, I should have gotten seed. I'm an idiot. Can I grow sunflowers during this season? Wait, inventory full. Of what? Oh, a bunch of stuff, okay. Oh, I remember last time I got hungry and I wanted to... I wanted to eat blueberries. I'm not as high this time, so... <laughs> not as appealing. Okay, do I need any of this other stuff? Like... I feel like the stuff I should put in my chest. Yes. Do not need bug meat. Thanks, Oliver. On a scale of one to ten, how do I rate hot vax summer? I would say it was a solid three. I don't know, I somehow imagined it being much more exciting than it was. Guys, I can't believe this summer is like over. It's like real summer, not the game. Like this summer was supposed to like save me 
I kind of like built up in my head that the summer was going to save me. And it, it totally didn't. <laughs> so now I'm like, how am I going to live for another year? Like, how am I going to be alive in spring 2022? I don't know. I'm, I'm concerned about it. I guess I'll have to give people gifts. <laughs> Try not to go completely insane. Thanks, Lesko. Clay, great. Okay, I need some seeds. Guys, we're just gonna have to do a lot of Stardew Valley streams. Stardew Valley streams all winter, every single day. That might be what it takes, I don't know. What was that? Stop it. Okay. Thanks, lady. Uh, he claims to be philosophically amusing, but it feels like emotional neglect. How do you separate intellectual life? Well, here's the thing. Like, philosophy has no business in talk about interpersonal relationships. So if you're trying to talk about relationship and feelings and shit, and he's getting all fucking Kierkegaard on you, then you gotta, there just needs to be a rule against that. It needs to be understood that Foucault or whoever the fuck has nothing to do with actual human relationships. And you just need to, you just need to. It sounds like you're asking me to tell you to dump him, to be quite honest. And if you need to, I guess you need to, but you could try first, you know, communicating. Communicate. If it's annoying, like, if if this shit he's doing that's annoying you, don't tell me. Tell him, you know? And, 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 and talk through it. I feel like that's, like, advice I, I give to, like, women dating men in general. I feel like I'm giving this advice a lot. If you're dissatisfied with your boyfriend, instead of finding the closest lesbian and complaining about it, <laughs> talk to your fucking boyfriend. <laughs> Goddamn. Okay, we're doing some high level farming here. Many advice column stream. What's with the cursed stream title? Have you seen my streams before? Which one of them does not have cursed a title? So now people are telling me to cut the grass. Thanks, peepers. <laughs> I think we all felt it. Oh, I need to get the bigger or the copper axe or whatever.
Have I tried watering Haley? No, I haven't. It's a good, good, uh, good suggestion. Thanks, Shane. Comfy clothes season. Yeah, I guess I'll try to think of it that way. Okay, we can give the hot pepper to Emily, right? Wants spicy food. Can maybe give that to Emily. Thanks, D. Quinn. Oh, I gotta eat something. Or I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass out my own farm. Okay, grapes. I wish I had grapes in real life. Actually, I like grapes. It, an emotional support chicken. Is that what we need? I feel like my energy in real life is waning a little bit. I need to eat grapes in a second. <laughs> Thanks, lady. I'm glad to hear it. That that's that's really that that's that's kind of where I always wish these discussions would end up, and they tend not to. So thank thank you. <laughs> thank you for, thank you for reaching the correct conclusion. <laughs> I need seeds, seeds, children. I need to plant seeds. We've got a lot of land and nothing growing on it. Um, okay. Oh, the sweet peas and the spice berries away, maybe. It's a lot of sap. Nothing good to do with sap, though, really. Um, I wish I had actual grapes. Oh fuck, I'm literally about to pass out. Okay, grapes. Eat. Yes. Thanks, Cherry. Is Jigglypuff a cat girl? I don't I don't think so. I think Jigglypuff is her own little thing, you know? I don't think Jigglypuff is in anything except a Jigglypuff, you know? Jigglypuff transcends gender, yeah. Transcends gender, transcends species. Probably transcends space and time as hell. Thanks, Eleanor. Uh, I actually am partial to red grapes myself, but I like a mix. You know, I actually love... Um, in, in, in the UK, actually, at some of the grocery stores you can buy, it's like a little plastic box that, that has a mix of red and green grapes. And I enjoy, like the un-American thrill of grape miscegenation, you know? <laughs> I feel like you, you can't get that here. Thanks, George. You have to find spiders for your lab that I would, I would not last one day of that job. <laughs> Thanks, Isabel. Cotton candy grapes. Ooh, yeah, that sounds good. What are some of my favorite movies? Well, oh god, it's hard to think of. Th I mean, I've been watching Black Swan. I've been rewatching even since the video came out. I've rewatched it like twice because I keep showing it to people. I like. I think I identify with that movie a lot for a lot of reasons, but uh, I guess it's one of my favorite movies. I don't know. What what what's a? I think I watch, I watch a lot of movies that I kind of don't like. <laughs> you know, there's like reasons to do things besides liking it. Um. Sorry, I'm not farming well because I'm like too on the chat. Um, I'm a I like many passages of Disney's Fantasia. That's got to be since childhood one of my favorite movies. Although it also has it also has some parts that are a little bit yikesy. Maybe don't <laughs> maybe don't make the mushrooms racist. Maybe. Thanks, Liv. <laughs> I 
thanks for thanks for the warnings about New Zealand. <laughs> We started. We started New Zealand discords. Uh, Perfect Blue is a very good movie, but it's hard to watch. Harder than Black Swan. Paprika. Okay, I like Paprika. Paprika is like Paprika might be the ultimate drug movie. Like, have have I? Is there a movie that is better to watch on drugs than Paprika? If there is, I don't think I've found it. Oh, thanks, Emily. Craft field snacks for energy. I need to like, make like, pies and things. Thanks, Kim. That uh, sounds like a good match. <laughs> thanks, uh, Talma Tomane. I'm sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. Uh, no, I unfortunately I don't have a PO box or anything in part because I'm like afraid of people, I don't know, sending me anthrax or whatever. I should just build up an immunity to anthrax. <laughs> Is there an anthrax vaccine? Boy, does that sound like a crackhead idea. Maybe take it easy on my grapes. Go to bed. <laughs> I want to move my bed back. I have to move the bed for the cat. Ridiculous. Okay, good night, cat. Oh, someone in the chat. Uh, a level two foraging. Great. New recipe survival burger. Wait, someone likes survival burgers. Yeah, I do not suggest watching Enter the Void on drugs, honestly. Unless you enjoy feeling intense and acute existential dread. I do not suggest watching Enter the Void, and especially not on drugs. Because I have 4,000 gold. What am I going to even do with it? I guess buy seeds. I keep forgetting. I have so much. I'm so rich. Hey, I, I did friends. Okay, great. Thanks, Dokukan. Dokukan, sorry. A Matrix 4 reaction watch? Yeah, I haven't watched that yet. Okay, pause. Is this paused? Yes. Okay, um... I'm gonna go look for grapes. <laughs> Flush, see whatever else I actually have in the kitchen. And, uh... I'll be right back. Screaming late at night, ridiculous.
Okay, I <laughs> I literally have blueberries, which is pretty. It's not grapes, but it's actually it's at least as exciting, I think. I know we weren't thinking about um. We weren't thinking about. We weren't thinking about. Let me let me just. They don't look very good because this lighting is not very good, but. They are, in fact, blueberries. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I suggest watching Requiem for a Dream on drugs, though. I'm not sure. I, I'm not sure that I suggest watch. I'm not sure that I suggest watching Requiem for a Dream at all. <laughs> I mean, it's like um, it's got good editing in it, like very, very iconic editing. But it's a little bit, um, it's a little don't do drugs, you know, as a movie. Thanks, Malignant. Um, I don't know what to tell you. Find a mommy dummy. Yeah. LMAO, imagine supporting Trump. In this year of our Lord. Honestly, incredibly embarrassing. <laughs> incredibly embarrassing behavior. Thanks, lady. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sounds good. Lady, aren't you in New Zealand? Is this a real fantasy or is this some kind of I'm mad at my boyfriend tonight fantasy? <laughs> yeah, I'm learning. I'm learning. I'm learning to see through the lies. Uh, thanks, Alice. Yeah, I have seen Heather's. I like Heather's. I love one in a writer. Just in general, so. Uh, let's get these peppers. Okay, seeds. Seeds, children. Oh wait, no, I want one of these. To give to Emily. Okay. Let's go. Ugh, my hair looks worse. My hair is very, like, well, I'm very particular, but... <laughs> the problem with this game is it's a little too green, and the green shines on my face, and it gives me this sickly... Alright, I'm just not gonna look at myself. Problem solved. Okay, it's too early. Ugh. I should have thought about this. I'm gonna eat some blueberries. <laughs> I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna put some blueberries in the wine. There we go. And my nails are kind of blueberry too. Oh, 9-11's over. Okay. Well, that was, you know. Okay, one more hour. I'm just gonna pace outside. Pierre, Pierre, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready to make purchases, Pierre. Shane. I don't know, Shane. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm restless leg syndroming. That camera. <laughs> well, God, you two are such good fucking friends. Here, I'm waiting outside like a sad puppy. Thanks, lady. It's <laughs> very kind of you. I wish you could buy. I <laughs> 
I wish someone would buy me flowers. Okay, blueberries. They, that turned out to be a good investment last time. Let's let's reinvest in blueberries. That's called economics, okay? Uh, maybe a couple more pepper seeds. Poppies? No, we're staying away from that. I'm, <laughs> I'm uh, trying not to. Thanks, Anna. Corn. Yeah. Okay, this is now a sunflower farm. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is it's a little out of control here. Should I should I get good at cooking in the game? I mean, is that should I become a a baker? Let me get some melons. Okay. Do I have anything to sell to him? I feel like these spangles aren't doing a lot for me. I guess, I don't know. I don't really need these things. Okay. We did it. It's time to go plant some, some sunflowers. This is now... <laughs> A fully industrial sunflower production farm. <laughs> Am I a good cook in real life? I'm okay. I tend not to cook that much because I'm lazy, but I do like it. All right, let's um. Let's plant this shit. Wait, I get my hoe out. Hoe's mad. Sorry, that was cringe. It's a difficult life being cringe. Well, look at the title of this stream. We've committed to the cringe. Cringe is okay as long as you commit to it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, if you're confident enough, nothing is cringe. Thanks, um. El Pollo Loco? I don't think so. I don't think we, I don't know. Do we have that in Baltimore? Baltimore chat, <laughs> let me know. Uh, thanks, Noah. Is it worth it to go to grad school next year? Um, I would say only go to grad school if you're just like dying to go to grad school. Don't go to grad school just because it's something to do, you know? I feel like that's kind of why I went to grad school because it was something to do. Not a good enough reason. Okay, now we need a separate sunflower plot. Okay, I'm gonna give. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna dig my own um, specific sunflower Haley adoration farm <laughs> over here. <laughs> oh God. Okay, confidence. It's not cringe if you do it confidently. That's the principle that we're committing to here. Okay. I have the utmost confidence. I've never been more confident in my goddamn life. Tommy, I've never cringed. Thank you. See, that's the energy. That's the energy that I'm trying to bring. I have never cringed. I don't even know what it is to cringe. <laughs> Thank you. That's exactly what I needed. Thank you, Ben. Uh, no, the game is chill. It's just that the chat isn't. <laughs> Sorry, I love you guys. But you're not chill. You're not. You know what? Cringe is pretty cringe. Cringing is pretty cringe. It's true. Okay, how many days left of summer we have? The 15th. Okay, so we have, we've got time. We've got 13 days left. That's long enough to get a, a big crop of sunflowers. Because we, I don't know, can you like keep sunflowers to the winter? Because we're going to need to keep the sunflowers. We're going to need to keep the, the, the sunflowers rolling in. You know what I'm saying? 
Okay. <laughs> me making a sunflower farm for Haley does not mean that I'm not chill. Okay. <laughs> okay, it's a very chill sunflower farm. She's. We're not going to tell her about the sunflower farm until later. You know what I'm saying? Until it's too late. Until she's already so committed to me that she can't. This it's you know. That this that she actually she'll actually by the time she finds out about the sunflower farm she'll think she'll have to think that it's cute is what I'm saying you know. Obviously, we need to go to every measure to conceal at the moment that we have a dedicated Haley themed sunflower farm. There's no need to mention that. It'll it'll come out eventually, I'm assuming. But in fact, maybe it may, you know maybe it doesn't even need to come out. Maybe it, need, it doesn't need to come out ever. If we play our cards right, I don't see any reason why Haley has to know where these sunflowers are coming from. <laughs> see, I'm trying to use my head. I'm being thoughtful. I'm not looking to repeat the potato incident. This is really a masterclass in simping here. Like, I'm showing you guys how it's done. <laughs> this is my next stream will be called Simping, a masterclass. Okay. Um... I feel like this is bothering me. I want one more sunflower seed so that that's not bothering me. Okay. Uh, I will. F I'll flirt. With, I'll, <laughs> I'll flirt with the other bachelorettes too, but I'm not gonna have a. Sp I'm not like I'm not building more dedicated creepy. Let's. It's been too long since we looked at my creepy love notebook. <laughs> Let's see how that's coming along. Look how creepy this notebook is. It's so creepy. Like, single, in parentheses. Like, this is a creepy notebook. I'm sorry, if I, if I like, knew a person in real life... <laughs> thanks, Francesca. Thanks for the encouragement. If I, if I found a person, like, who I was friends with, and I found that they had a notebook, and their notebook had a name of, like, everyone they knew in it, and every single single person had single, in parentheses, and then a series of hearts or not hearts. Like, this is like notes on a scandal level, like, lesbian predator behavior. Look at, I mean, it's, it's actually bisexual predator behavior because everyone is in this book. And I guess, um, I guess this game takes like the Sims approach to sexual orientation, which is just to say, fuck it, everyone's bisexual. Which I admire. I, admi I admire. Hey, that's a, it's a bold stand to take. The everyone is by stand is very hello. <laughs> Guys, I need to I need to bring it down perhaps bring it down one one level. You found some wild fruits. Okay. Uh how do you feel about wait, Leia, how do you feel about driftwood? Okay, you feel good about it. I'm feeling good about it too. Forced bisexualization. I support it. I don't. Um, I support it in video games. I think it's okay. Um. Uh, not now. Uh, Pierre. Pierre. Pierre, come over here and tend the shop, you little bitch. <laughs> um, it's time. <laughs> Pierre, Pierre, it's time to come tend the shop. <laughs> oh my god, dude, is he really gonna just stand there? <laughs> Thank you, Fi Geek. I'm glad I have an entry in your creepy in your creepy love notebook. You're a child. I think you're no, you're not a child. Okay. There's limits. We have we have. Okay, guys, this is part of the simping masterclass. 
No simping until you verify that someone is an adult. I feel like that's, you know, basic shit, but some people, you'd be surprised by the things that people overlook and they're simping. You know, you don't, we don't want to be James Charles. Okay, Abigail, how do you feel about acorns? Okay, you don't love it. That's fair. <laughs> well, I'm kind of trying to, I think Abigail needs to be negged a little bit. <laughs> At this juncture. Let's consult the notebook. How are things coming? Um, okay, we're, we're on two hearts with... We're on two hearts with Leia. Yeah. Pierce, is Pierce still really a front? That would explain some things. Uh, thank you, Skylark. How would you send me fan art? Honestly, just tweet it at me. <laughs> tweet it at me because, um, as we've previously discussed, I don't really have an address that I make public because, you know, being trans online. <laughs> just actually, it's not even being trans online. It's being online. Like, that's, I think, really my sweet kitty. Meow, meow. Wait, is it, am I ready to sleep for the night? Have I? Okay, I think. Yeah, I guess it's fine. Okay, profits are down. We need to. Uh, we need to step it up. I guess not every day is harvest day, so that makes sense. I like blueberries. Ooh, we've got a harvest. We've got tomatoes. Pretty. Is that poppy? Okay. Control yourself. No. Let's just get rid of this. Let's not let's not take any chances with poppies. No good will come of that. You know what I'm saying? The sitar jam is back. Thanks, thanks, Shalom. I haven't, I have not watched Fantasia 2000. I think probably since like the year 2000. I remember liking the um, like the the Gershwin Rhapsody and Blues section, but I think that ultimately I did, I couldn't get into it as much as the original Fantasia. But I remember that. Okay, I remember the whales. And I remember, is Wales also Stravinsky? Or no, it's like Fire. There's like a fi Stravinsky Firebird Suite somewhere. And then there's also uh, Gershwin, Rhapsody in Blue. I remember that. Thanks, Oliver. I'm not sure that I would say I enjoy seducing video game characters. I I don't know. Do I enjoy this? I feel like I, my my feelings are more ambivalent. But it makes for it makes for good content. So, you know. I was even more ambivalent about Doki Doki, to be honest. Like, if that game hadn't been so uncomfortable, like before it got uncomfortable, I feel like we would have had a better time playing through it. You know what I'm saying? I like this music, but I miss the spring music. I miss those marimbas. You know what I'm talking about. Guys, I feel like my farming has become extremely high efficiency. <laughs> Lady, this is a this is a wild plot twist. I, I'm I'm loving this from you. This is it's not the direction I was expecting this to go. I'll be honest. I I did. I, I didn't- I didn't have faith in you, but, but you've proved me wrong. And for the record, if we were not on the literal opposite sides of Magellan's sucking journey right now, I would be fully down to go, go get a drink. And uh, listen to you complain about your boyfriend and then go home and wonder why I did it later. <laughs> Uh, okay.
Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm killing it, guys. I'm, I'm doing amazing. <laughs> I'm just kidding, lady. Yeah, Lady is kind of stealing me. You guys need to step it up. I guess what we learned that, that what works on me is just being super aggressive. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. I wouldn't say she's being aggressive. Just being assertive. What? Mia sell hats. Okay, Poke. Come to old, old house, Poke. Okay, so some crackhead le left me a message and wants to sell me hats. <laughs> Thanks, Derek. Thanks, Trash. I have not seen Tekken Concrete. Sorry, I can't say words. Lady ran out of money. What did she actually? <laughs> no. What about those flowers? <laughs> Can you at least send me an emoji bouquet? I would appreciate it. Uh, okay. Seeds. We need one more sunflower seed. Marnie. Your nephew, Marty, you're not single, but your nephew Shane is. Yeah, but I'm not into, I'm not into Shane's. L word Shane accepted, of course. Okay, someone, someone, someone sent me an emoji bouquet. Thank you. That's, I needed that. Uh, one more sunflower, just to balance things out. Do I need anything else? I guess. Not really. Oh, thanks, Janet. Uh, oh, piano covers the music from Stardew. Yeah, that would be fun. I'll have to do my beloved spring, my spring mix. <laughs> uh, thanks, Raymond. Have I actually read any Chekhov? I feel like I have, but it was a while ago. <laughs> I'm not single, but my nephew is. <laughs> Uh, those people are real, dude. Like, I I once, I was on a plane, and I sat next to a grandmother from Texas who basically was, like, tr the whole flight, she was trying to, like, convince me to, to like, she was trying to set me up with her grandson. Uh, <laughs> because she was like, you're very tall. How tall are you? Well, my grandson is six foot seven, and he is a petroleum engineer, and blah, 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 blah. <laughs> and, like... She was fully, she was fully trying to get me interested. Thanks, existential ho. <laughs> You're very welcome. It's true. I could have. I could have. I could have married a petroleum engineer. I'm, I'm missing out. A six foot seven petroleum engineer. Thanks, Evelyn. Thanks, Harriet. What brought me to Baltimore? Uh, I moved here for a relationship, which you know, ended shortly thereafter. As you know, it turns out being in a relationship with someone who lives in the same city is often quite different. <laughs> And being in a relationship with someone who lives in a different city is a different set of skills and a different set of compatibilities. Um, do I like Baltimore? Yeah, actually, I do. Th thanks, Daria. Uh, 
stop saying crackhead. I guess is this is it a demeaning term? I guess I, I feel I, I feel like I can say these things because of my colorful history of junky behavior. To put it lightly. <laughs> Dear Cataly, how is the country life going for you? It's been lonely here without you. Oh, it's my dad. Okay. But I'm proud of what you're doing. Uh, okay. Thanks, Grandpa. It's great. I don't know. What do you guys think? Am I... Am I entitled to reclaim... <laughs> to reclaim this... Let's not even let's not even go there. Um, okay, it's it's three twenty p.m. Our crops are watered. It's either to the mines or to to the the seduction fields. <laughs> Thanks, Billy. You know, I haven't. I actually haven't. Um, I actually haven't seen Euphoria yet. And I think part of it is that I know that I will ha I'll have like a whole envy complex about Hunter Schaefer. And so I've been avoiding it for that reason, but I guess I should just get over it. <laughs> right? I made... Okay, the Mayans. I feel like the Mayans is the safer option at this stage. Thanks, Sam. Oh man, Arundel Mills. What a wild place. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, lady. Got your, got your. She got, she got her insurance pay payments figured out to, to super chat me more. Okay, I'll, I'll support this. I'll go along with this. Uh, my day, it's been fine. My love life is, uh, has room to, for improvement. Not, I'm uh, not really dating anyone right now. You know, I've got, I've always, I've always got some people, you know, around. Some options. I like to get, I like to have options, but, uh, I, I, and I don't currently have any commitment. Let's leave it at that. Um, Abigail, what are we doing here, Abigail? Are you playing the panpipe? Because if so, I'm into it. She won't even talk to me. Is she still mad about the whole acorn thing? No, I'm trying to give it to Abigail. No. I... Okay, well, she's lost. She's, uh... She's in a Dionysian trance. Well, these things happen. <laughs> Lady, she's really going for it. I, I mean, I admire, I admire the audacity. Okay. Asking how, imagine asking how's your dating life to a person who's at midnight on a Saturday night playing Stardew Valley. It, that's, I mean, I mean, I feel like we're on the same page here. So I'm playing, you're watching. Thanks, Jacob. Favorite comfort YouTuber? Oh, uh, I guess I've got a few. Um, Bailey Sarian has been a comfort YouTuber lately. Uh, thanks, Evelyn. Uh, thank you and thank your mom for bankrolling this. I support you. When I was your age, I, I also did shit like that, so good for you. Thanks, Dogukon. 
Istanbul. Oh my god. Yeah, I would love to visit some place more interesting like that. I am more interesting than the places that I have been. I have not traveled a lot. I want to. I feel like I finally have like the money to travel and then COVID happened. Typical. Oh fuck, we gotta get a sword out. I've got a beetle thing. Okay. Oh fuck, energy is not doing great. It's not doing great, kids. Thanks, Christian. Webbed. Okay, I'll look into it. Check it out. Thanks, Jacob. Hunter wins VTuber when I when I'm not beautiful anymore. <laughs> okay, I think I should get out of here because my energy situation. How could Lindsay Ellis be my comfort YouTuber when we're in the midst of a fierce feud? <laughs> Use your heads, people. Thanks, Eddie. Do I think Jeffree Star actually slept with Kanye? You know, I I don't think it's my, any of my business. Thanks, Ben. Uh, I feel like everyone hates the drivers from like a... Because here's, here's what it is, right? If you live in Northern Virginia, you notice Maryland drivers because they're less common, but still common enough. Okay. Is this the mouse? Is this the mouse man that put... Put the note in my... Mailbox? Filthy varmints. Okay, George. It's, it's called bigotry. I mean, I, I got scold scolded for saying crackheads earlier. <laughs> and you're just calling people varmint? Okay. Thanks, Math Rock. 420. I hasten to add. <laughs> yeah, I got it. I got it, George. Mm hmm. All right, Linus, we need to have a chat. What's What's up? What's going on, Linus? What's with this trash thing? Linus, do you, do you need to talk? Linus, do you need me to bake you a pie? Because I'll bake you a fucking pie. Um. Wow, they're giving me really judgmental options. This game is actually active, actively participating in the marginalization of unhoused persons. Sorry. Uh, okay. No, okay, no. It's a shame for food to go to waste, right? Yeah, I'm still... Linus, it doesn't get any more open-minded than me. By the way, got any crack? <laughs> I'm sorry. So sorry. I'd like to apologize. I'd like to, to take accountability and and learn from learn from my mistakes. Yeah, I'll tell him that. But Linus, you gotta you gotta rummage through other people's trash cans for a week, okay, buddy? Lay low, you know? Keep a low profile. Try not to make too much noise. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Thank Gus is being a decent person. Thanks, Sean. Thanks, Vikeek. <laughs> I think I actually need to dial this, dial this down a little bit. Oh, hey, Haley, you're welcome. Glad you liked the potato. I'm glad that, that there's like Haley's around here who appreciate, appreciate tubers, you know? 
Oh my god. Lady, lady is digging into the meth budget. He's digging them. You know, I really, that's, that, that means a lot to me, lady, because I know, I know how fun meth is. And then, if, you're, if you're spending money on me instead of meth, I, I mean, you must be, you must be pretty serious about this. Thanks, Tristan. This, this stream has taken a turn. Children, this is what we call a turn. There's also a lot of like ethic ethically questionable super chats coming in, <laughs> like, like like children stealing their parents' money to give to me. <laughs> I guess actually spending meth money on me instead is good because fun though it is, meth is not a good habit. It's not a good thing to do. It's um it's it's really more trouble than it's worth. Uh thanks, Haley. Yeah, it is a good source of carbs, especially in, you know, times of scarcity like this. Potatoes are actually are pretty valuable. I mean, 19th century Ireland. No one was complaining. It's not even, let's just stop talking. Shh, shh, shh. Quiet. Thank you, Cole. Oh yeah, people, a, a few people have mentioned to me ambition and minuet and power. Oh, it's set in the French Revolution. Oh my God. Yeah, I should absolutely play that. <laughs> Thanks, Francesca. Uh, thanks, <laughs> thanks, Stormy. Well, now I've got Lady Andermeth dealer giving me money. I'll, you know, I'll take it. I'll tell you what, Stormy. The with the super, I will. The money that the money that I'm getting from Lady's super chats, I'm gonna use to score later. So hit me up after the stream. <laughs> Oh my god, we gotta, we gotta, we need to calm down. Can we, can we, can we take things down one notch? I'm, I'm really telling this to myself more than anyone else. I, he like, why has every other stream, like we've done, we've done so many streams of this and it's been so relaxing. And tonight it's, it's just like, a, it's a much sharper energy. You know what I'm saying? I guess it's my fault. It's not my fault. It's Saturday night, you know? It's 9-11. It's 9-11. People are gonna be... There's a, there's a certain energy in the air, and it's it's getting to all of us, you know? It's been a... It's been a difficult 20 years, and like... You know, 9-11. The trauma has affected us all. And... Uh, thanks, Trampan. Thoughts on Hipparchia of Marinia. Wait, who is that? I feel like this person has come up. Hipparchia has come up in my Patreon streams before, but I forget. <laughs> I forget who she is. It's a cool name, Hipparchia. I think it's one of the coolest names I've ever heard. At least his music is, is is nice. Music is chill, even if if I'm not and the chat isn't. <laughs> the other thing that's striking. Actually, I can't say the other thing that's striking until I'm about to end the stream. When I'm when I'm about to when I'm about to say goodnight, remind me to tell you what is striking, and I'll and I'll bring it up then. I can't tell you now. Thanks, Jacob. Flares. The piercing. What? Thanks, Oklahoma. Oh, Oklahoma hormone. I got it. Freaked it out. I'm genius. Okay, was Sappho legit bisexual or lesbian who was with men out of societal pressure? The bi community tends to get pissed if you said she was lesbian. Um, I don't think anyone knows the answer to that question, to be quite honest. Like, we don't even have 
do, do we even have a single complete poem by Sappho? We have these fragments, right? Uh, I have my ideas, Sean. Thank you. I don't- I don't think there's any basis- like, there's not that much biographical information available about Sappho, so as far as I'm concerned, this is a merely symbolic struggle with no actual historical facts involved. It's like, who threw the first brick at Stonewall, right? Like, we don't even know if there was a single brick thrown at Stonewall, much less who threw it. Like, this is all speculation driven by, like, LGBT infighting, you know? Thanks, Daniel. Let's find something better to do with our time than argue about whether Sappho was bi or gay or who th threw what brick. The point is gay liberation now or whatever, right? It's not pretty, like these things, these are, these, these things don't matter, right? Um, I've never played Life is Strange, never heard of it. Thanks, Daniel. Uh, thanks, Sean. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I do need a drink soon. That's a good point. Um, okay, should I, should I do- should I get a drink now, or should I do one more day before I get a drink? I feel like I haven't- have, I haven't fed the cat in a while. Where is the cat? talking around. Thanks, Ben. I have not watched Real Wives of the Potomac, no. Am I missing out? Oh, I've got weed seeds. Well, let's at least remember to plant those. Thanks, Oliver. That's true. That's a good point. Okay, I'm gonna get a drink. Let's all take some deep breaths. And we'll be right back after these messages.
Okay. We are back. These birds are, are, are peaceful, don't you think? I feel I feel very at peace. I'm a <laughs> I got a beer, but I'm gonna drink it out of this wine glass because um well it's more elegant that way. Also, to be completely honest with you, and to be completely transparent, to have full accountability and full transparency, and just to work on myself and to be fully, like, transparently accountable. The, the beer is, tr is from, like, a justifiably canceled brewery that I have because it's just, like, what they had at the store. Um, but anyway, cheers. <laughs> Wow, so fucking elegant, amazing. <laughs> really, I'm I'm doing so good. Um, all right, accountability stream. From now on, we're just gonna hold ourselves so fucking accountable. Thanks, Champan. Hyparchia was a cynic philosopher from... Okay, I knew she was a philosopher. Um, married Crates, boned in the street? Wow, that's wild. So she was like a Linus. She would hang out with Linus, is what you're saying? <laughs> Linus and Diogenes. I feel like Linus is the Diogenes of Stardew Valley. Thanks, Emerald. Favorite Lundy Williams moment? What is it? She's an icon, she's a legend, and she is at the moment. I guess that's the one I quote the most. Because everyone quotes it, it's a, it's a meme. Uh, thanks, Oklahoma Hormone. No comment. Uh, is New, New Zealand representing in the chat? See, I think that's people. People complain at what time I stream. Should consider that. That's pretty like. That's pretty dehumanizing towards the people from New Zealand. <laughs> so maybe think about that. Maybe hold yourselves accountable. Okay, um, I'm being a little shit tonight, aren't I? <laughs> yeah, so is the chat. I'm just, I'm just like, like, I tend to have like mirror the chat's energy. So when the chat's being bratty, I get bratty. Thanks, Adam. Uh, you're very welcome. <laughs> Thanks, Ben. Thanks, Ben's drunk GF. I'm glad, <laughs> glad you like my voice. Um, Emily, how are you doing? No, it doesn't rain much in summer. Well, weather. Okay, hold on. I gotta bring up my creepy, my creepy love notes. Okay, you like nothing I have. Great. Amazing. Oh, we gotta, that reminds me, we gotta go to the blacksmith. We gotta do a lot of things. Let's go mining. Mining right now. I said, New, that's right. I said New Zealand, right? Nar. Nar. Is that how you say that? Nar. I don't know. I'm just kidding. New Zealand people aren't people. People from New Zealand, if you know what I mean. It is. It's a bratty loop. Br bratily. <laughs> you guys have brought out bratily by acting like little brats yourselves. Thanks, Benjamin. Thanks, Jorge. Which Nick Cage movie is the Nick Cageiest? Oh, either it's that like what is that late '90s Michael Bay movie, or else it's no, no, <laughs> no, <laughs> or else it's um the Werner Herzog Bad Lieutenant. <laughs> Robin, you're married. Thanks, Brian. That's a good point. New Zealand is not real. 
I'm a New Zealand truther. Okay, Linus. How are you doing? This is a wellness check. That's fair. Do I have anything you want? Not really. <laughs> I don't think I don't have anything anyone wants. No. This is gonna get annoying fast. Thanks, Paige. What if we all move to New Zealand tonight? It's annoying. Okay, that didn't work. Yeah, I'm a New Zealand denier. <laughs> Linus doesn't want my pity, fair enough. I don't want anyone's pity either. Why can't I? I'm not good at. I'm not good at finding the mines. Oh, I didn't go far enough. That's the exact opposite problem. No. <laughs> That's so cute. I do think I do think Australian and Kiwi accents are adorable. Okay. So. That's one thing they've got going for them. Okay, the mines. I found it. I was gonna sword out. <laughs> oh god, and I'm a sword lesbian. Cringe. Wait, no, no cringing. We said no cringing. No cringing allowed. Confidence. Um, I'm gonna need to eat. Like, god damn it! I need to bring more food into these mines. I always forget that now. Ah, fine. Great. Stop, just what I fucking needed. I can go to the, I can use the elevator to go to lower levels. Okay. You can work this out. Oh, look, it's um quartz. Oh, okay, great. Well, where is the elevator? Oh fuck, my energy is like drastic. Drastically low. Yeah, I'll eat hot peppers. That'll that'll energize me. Okay, that did nothing. <laughs> no. Okay. Guys, my energy's too low. This is not very sliving. Yes, leave the mine. I guess I just go home, yeah. Maybe I can sleep with sleep in Linus's shanty town since I didn't rat him out. I guess it's not a shanty town if there's only one shant. If there's only one shanty. I'm noticing there's no cops in this game. They've they've abolished the police in Stardew Valley, I see. <laughs> Thanks, Dilly. Uh what do you do to reduce upper body muscle? 
they on hormones don't exercise upper body muscles and lose weight <laughs> like i mean don't cancel me for saying lose weight but i'm not saying that you should i'm just saying that hypothetically that would be how you did it okay lady let's 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 hear it okay mary jane hyder okay i'm uh i'm i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna lady i'm gonna or mary or i'm gonna i'm gonna screenshot you mary and i'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna take you up on this, okay? <laughs> so you'll be hearing from me tomorrow, and I'm gonna convince you to leave your boyfriend. So get ready for that. <laughs> Chat. What do you think are the odds that, that she completely forgets that this ever happened? And then I'm gonna like show up on her DMs on Twitter tomorrow, being like, "Leave your boyfriend," and she's gonna be like, "Why? What are you talking about? Why is this YouTuber harassing me?" <laughs> she's, gonna... she's gonna screenshot it. <laughs> okay, I'm not. We're not turning a profit here at Weed Farm, 420 Farm. It's becoming an area of concern. I'm keeping an eye on it. Okay, we've got a massive blueberry harvest and that's gonna bankroll whatever my next projects are. I love the way the blueberries pop out. Pop off, sis. <laughs> what is the thing that trick CSA like making fun of their own white white fans attempt to speak off? It's pop off wig. <laughs> Terrible. Okay. What is going on with this thing? This shrivel? Should I... Should I scythe it? I scythed it. He has a pop off wig, go in. Exactly. Where did that meow come from? Meow? Where is that sweet little meow coming from? Thanks, Jess. I support your falafel journey. Thanks, Cherry. God, that whole shrimp thing. That was... Thanks, Cloudies. I hope you're enjoying this one. I have this like anxiety like brewing in me that like this stream is inferior to my other Stardew Valley streams. Cause I feel like it's been less chill and like a little bit more like it's been a little more like jittery, a little more <laughs> It's just had a harsher energy. I don't know, am I making this up? Am I crazy? Am I I guess, I guess it's a self-fulfilling prophecy, right? If you feel like that, then it's true. Thanks, Dilly. Oh, what did I do personally? Yeah, I kind of just, like, I kind of just w was on hormones and lost 10 pounds. 
that's that's all I did. There was no like secret like muscle reduction thing. <laughs> Thanks, rookie. That means a lot. That my that my stream is on periodic tables. It's really, it's really important to me. Thanks, Drew. Oh God, I've turned the chat. The, the chat has become as cursed as the stream title. Well, it's what I deserve. You know, I guess I really invited this entire energy by making the title of the stream. Sapphic Seduction Secrets or whatever. I can't even remember. I can't even remember what I said the title of the stream was. Uh, yeah, no, Oklahormone. Someone definitely got shrimp. They got my shrimp instead of chicken and fries. So I hope they like shrimp. Thanks, Dilly. You too. Okay, I'm gonna try to bring it down a level. Where's my vape? That's that's the problem. There's a, there's a missing ingredient here. Actually, I'm gonna. Where's the? I'm also. Where's my? Okay, it's in my pocket. <laughs> Guys, I'm I'm slaying this challenge. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. Oh yeah, those Alex, are you on do you have California gummies? I love I love a California gummy. California is wild now. Like these like the fucking Steve Jobs Apple stores they have for your Indicas and your Sativas. Thanks, Soraya. Ravioli, really? Ravioli, why am I degenerate? Because, uh, God is dead and we've killed him, Nia. Yeah. I don't know, Caroline. You're gonna have to figure that one out. And you kind of need to... One of us needs to stand down. Thank you, Heart. That's very helpful. <laughs> yes, Queen, Queen Skinny Legend, Versace, Boot the House, Dance Play, Queen, Hunty, Mama, and I. Oop, Daddy, work, Charlie, the X, the X, snatch my wig. Oh, God. It hurts to say. It hurt, like, literally hurts my mouth on its way out. <laughs> Oh, I have so many blueberries. No, I gotta sell those in my in my box. I can't believe I forgot that. Okay, what am I? Is it too late in summer to start growing new things? I, I feel like um. Thanks, Ben. I'm glad you think so. Uh, and thank you, Luke. Luke, it's been unraveled since the beginning. Um. No, I think I can, I think I can, I think it's time, there's time for one more planting thing. Thanks, Onar. My favorite aw episode. <laughs> the House Down Mama. What is my favorite episode? Okay, so I really liked, okay, what was it? There was a recent episode, what was it about? Was it, about, was it called Disappointment? There's an episode about disappointment that I thought was one of the best ones in a long time. Thanks, Alfred. It's hard for me to, to to like remember individual episodes of uh because it all kind of like blurs together into one like giant hours long span of madness. <laughs> anyway, opulence is forever. Thank you, Alfred. I'm glad you liked it. Yeah, I'm always kind of trying to top that one myself from Charlie. Um, okay, I'm getting a little distracted here. Let's try to focus. Thanks, Shinji. Um, <laughs> no. I'm, I'm, Uh, 
Okay, kids, like, let's just focus a little bit. What are we doing here? We're getting energy. Okay, let's, I'm just gonna eat a blueberry. I'm gonna eat a blueberry in real life at the same time as I eat one of the game. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> Ready? No, I just threw that out, okay. Oh, that's a satisfying crunch. I guess I need to, um, I guess I need to cook. Is that what I need to do in the game to get more energy? Because I feel like I'm at a point, like, energy is like a significant limiting issue. No. <laughs> Thanks, rookie. Grass pipe, cake boss. Girl, right. I don't know about that. I had to eat more in the game or in real life. I just said, yeah, I had a fully immersive eating food experience. Is there, there's a spa? Where's this, where's this spa? You've got a nice house plant, dude. Okay, go to the saloon, yeah. Fishing? I could eat a fish, that's true. How's there a spa? I've never been to the spa. I'm supposed to get you a pale ale, Pam. All right, let's buy this spaghetti. That's a lot of energy. Oh, salad is a ton of energy. Wow, this game really, they really think highly of vegetable. Well, that makes sense. Pizza, nice. Oh, coffee. Oh, someone's saying people like coffee. Hash browns. It's a very farmer. Farmer food. Ooh, maki roll. Um, they don't... Okay. I should just... Okay, coffee. No. Chocolate cake. I guess I'll get a chocolate cake and then I can, I'll get a salad. Okay. I like the saloon music. It's, it's, yes. <laughs> Crunch. I crunched it. Okay, guys, I feel like I'm doing it now. I need another, no, I need a salad. And then I can go to the mines with my salad. You know, like miners do. <laughs> okay, I gotta get rid of some of this stuff though. Go to here one more time. No, you're not standing where you need to stand. <laughs> Wait, is that a... Can I sell things here? Like in the crate? No. <laughs> One miner's salad, please. Whoever in the chat just said that. Yes. Exactly. You get it. Okay, let's go north by... North by northeast. Abigail, do you like slime? Wow, I'm just nagging the shit out of Abigail, aren't I? Is this the spa? No. Not a spa. Wait, who lives here? Okay, I don't care about them anyway. Wait, Maru! I never see Maru because she's always hiding in her goddamn bedroom. All right, whatever. I'll take my I'll take my miner's salad elsewhere. Wait, is this not in the right place? Yes. 
It's confusing. You've got to go around. See, I could just, this kind of thing wouldn't be stressful if no one was watching. The problem is that people are watching. So I feel the need to be not just a gamer girl, but a girl gamer, if you know what I'm saying. Okay, is this where to find the good rocks? Stop it. Thanks, Fab. You're super welcome. I will <laughs> I'll make sure to water the entire entire grocery store. Stop it. Stop it. Uh, God, I'm waging a vicious war against this crab. Well, that's that's fair. Oh my god, it's like this thing is is resilient. I just expend a lot of energy on that. It's a good thing I've got that minor salad. <laughs> As a, I think it's like a minor salad, as opposed to a major salad, you know. The two salads. Salad minor, salad major. Um, thanks, Damascus. Yeah, I've, I definitely suggest recommend this game. If you like chill, relaxing experiences, especially, you know, if you're not streaming. Uh, thanks, Mary. Uh, yeah, that sounds a little too close to home, to be completely honest. Um, in fact, that kind of sounds the most close to home. See, I don't know if I want that. I want, I want to laugh at other people's problems. I don't, what is my problems? I'm like, no, <laughs> no, this isn't funny. Stop. <laughs> Um, okay. Oh my god, it's sl these slimes. Are these slimes getting more resilient? Are they learning? Are these slimes adapting? I don't know. These are the things I, I, that worry me at night. On Euclidean salad, okay. Also, like, we're getting a little bit in trouble here in terms of, like, time. Because it's getting kind of late. Wait, can I join the Adventurers Guild? How many slimes do I have to slay for that? A lot, apparently. Jesus. And it takes time. It's getting so late, guys. <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna pass out in this mine. I hate it when I pass out in a mine shaft. Okay, how do I... How do I get out of here? Okay, can I just... Yes, leave the mine, okay. Thanks, Oliver. Yes, I have considered writing a book. Um, I mean, I have like multiple book deal offers and I keep turning them down because I'm like, I don't have an idea. But when I have an idea for a book, I'll write it. <laughs> See, I'm actually, like, despite what people think, I'm actually not a complete hack. Like, I'm not just doing things for money. And I could actually make a lot more money if it was more of a hack. But I'm not a hack. I actually do care what I make. I could be way more of a crifter, is what I'm saying. Um, thanks, Shinji. Do I support a nation state for big booba goth GF? Sure. If that's what they want. <laughs> okay, shit. I'm about to. No, I'm going to pass out. It's over. I love leveling up, leveling up when I pass out in the middle of the road. 
Okay. Oh, choose profession. Oh, definitely tiller, right? No question. No doubt, no doubt. Oh god, now I'm gonna have to talk to whoever found me. Ugh, that's the worst part of this. I'm gonna have to be like, mm, thanks for saving me. I'm so great. Okay. Morris. Okay, well, I was found by Joja Mark. Last night, a Joja team member found you incapacitated. I love the corporate language. A medical team was dispatched to bring you home safe. Okay, good. You've been billed 143 gold for this room. Okay, honestly, fair enough. That was worth it. Honestly, this kind of makes... See, I don't, I don't get why people... I don't get why people get so mad about... I don't care why people get so mad about Joja Mart. Like, I feel like sometimes capitalism is is good. It's good if you have money. You know? <laughs> but I do have money. Look, I have 1289. I'm doing fine. I guess I'm, f I'm saying fairly obvious things here. Capitalism is good if you are the capitalist. Well, yeah. I mean, state, like, big s communism is good if you're the head of the Communist Party. <laughs> like, power is good if you have it. That's, oh, I think I just did it. I think I just discovered the real, the political truth, right? I hate power unless it's my power, and then it's good. <laughs> Isn't that how it works? Thanks, Jinji. No, I haven't. Inventory full. Okay, let's 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 sell some stuff. Uh goodbye, goodbye. Do I really need all this let's sell crab? Sell cherry bomb, sell oh blueberries, yeah. Bug me. Mm. So hang on to the rest of this. Thanks, Fi Geek. What's my opinion on Posadas? I don't even know who who that is, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know I act like I'm smart in my videos, but I'm actually not. Good night, Janet. Thank you. Where are my sunflowers? I'm ready for them. Oh, I sold that crab. No, I already wanted my my special Haley field. Wait, kitty. Meow. Okay, wait, do I have to har Okay, someone's saying harvest wheat. Do I have to scythe it? Thanks, JS. Yes, JS, I do remember that. See, opposition to the Iraq war was actually my first, like, my first, like, major political opinion that I had as a teenager. And I went, you know, I went to, like, the protests in, um, on the National Mall and all that. And that's where I kind of, like, first ran into, like, anarchists and hippies and all the people who corrupted me. Thanks, Emerald. Favorite Trisha Paytas troll moment. Uh, oh boy, there's a lot of those. I would have to say it's the one where she attempted to cook a Jewish meal for her Jewish husband or whatever, and she talked about how she was Jewish and just got everything wrong and was like, it just, it, it, like I was getting mad and I'm not even Jewish, so that's effective trolling. 
coming out as transgender is a little bit too obvious, in my opinion. A little bit too obvious of a troll move. <laughs> Thanks, Ben. Good night and enjoy the out of van. I just took a half Xanax, I'll be honest. <laughs> I was trying to bring it down a notch. I think I think it is bringing it down a notch. Actually, I'm, I'm, already, I'm already feeling like a much more soothing energy. Nine Eleven is responsible for contrapoint. Nine Eleven is responsible for the entire modern America, like everything. Um, I canceled for not knowing that Trisha Paytas is a he him king. <laughs> Sorry. Good. Uh, I just want to listen to sitar music. See, I told you the Xanax. It's really, uh, really doing its job. See, I didn't follow the chick, the the Oklahoma. I didn't follow the Trisha Paytas OnlyFans thing so I, I don't know what she did but I assume that it was funny because she is pretty funny like you gotta give her credit like she <laughs> correction you do not uh, let's issue a correction concerning an earlier statement about Trisha Paytas you do not under any circumstances gotta hand it to her <laughs> excuse me to the he him king Trisha Paytas Okay, uh, have we given up on farming? I just like blueberries so much. Let's just get a few more. Thanks, Rodrigo. You thought 9-11 was a movie? Yeah, that's a very, that's a fair five-year-old reaction. Xanax has Mar Martha Agri. Argerish. I can't even pronounce her name. Martha Argerish. Yeah, I... that sounds like a... <laughs> Xana. Sounds like a really Xanax time. Uh, thanks Sh Shinji. I don't really actually know. Um, I know in the US it really depends on what city you're in. Like, Baltimore is actually very good. Although I feel like it could actually... Oh boy, let's go on some crazy rant. Um, I feel like trans healthcare in the U.S. is declining in quality over the last few years because so many people are transitioning now that the wait lists for everything are crazily long, including like I can like I used to be able to just like walk into the the clinic and like there were no wait times and it was like fine and now at the same clinic like everything takes forever. And it's impossible to get a hold of them. They're constantly over is booked and overworked. And like to get surgery with any of the major surgeons in this country now, you have to you have to wait like years to get trans surgery because there's too many goddamn trans people. And I blame YouTubers, honestly. Like YouTubers made it okay to transition. And now I've like, I've ruined my own healthcare. I'm so mad. <laughs> yeah, the whole Iraq war, that was really a Bush family affair, wasn't it? Couldn't. Yeah, Japan is a forced sterilization. I've heard about that. Yeah, that's, that's unbased. I don't know what to tell you. I think it's eugenics, is what it is. I don't know, Cherry. Whenever you want it to be. You're right, we're supposed to be bringing it down. I'm bringing it up. I'm here, we need to be down here. I don't think Caitlyn Jenner made anyone transition.
Guys, you need to help me bring it down, okay? Which means that no more talking about Saddam Hussein. And no more talking about uh, George Bush. And no more talking about... No more talking about trans people. Honestly... <laughs> we just not talk about them? Us? I just like don't want to think about trans people right now. Sometimes I get tired of thinking about... <laughs> like even though I am trans, like I don't want to think about it, you know what I'm saying? I get bored. I get bored of it. Thanks, Rachel. I'm, um... <laughs> oh my god. Lady makes an appearance. I can bring it back up for you. For you. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a bunch of AMAs. I'm gonna post about it on Patreon tomorrow. So, on, if you're a patron, I'll put, I'm gonna, I've been like, I've been not posting to Patreon for like two weeks because I've been depressed and all I feel like doing is tweeting stupid shit. But I'm gonna, I, I swear to God, tomorrow is actually gonna be the day. Like, honestly, if I don't post to Patreon tomorrow, tomorrow, like, I give you permission to bother me about it. Because I need, I need to. Thanks, Ryan. Yes, just lesbians and farming. Oh my god. I'm just, should I just ignore the chat? I feel like... I feel like... Maybe next time I'll do this, I'll just turn super chats off. And just focus on farming. Because I've just... If I'm, so I'm just looking at the chat. Chat's not chill. And I'm not chill. It's fine. The Xanax is hitting. I'm relaxing. Ooh. Isn't that nice? Actually, I don't know how to feel about me being on Twitter. I've been tweeting like four times a day, at least, and deleting like half of them. I'm sort of not sure how... I, I kind of have a feeling that... Um... Like, it's, <laughs> I should not be tweeting so much, you know what I mean? Like, it's just not good for me to tweet that much. It's a waste of time. I'm going to get myself in trouble because I, I tweet stupid stuff, you know? And and my tweets just, it's, it's kind of wild though because I feel like my tweets just keep getting worse. But then more and more people follow me. Oh, wait, I'm supposed to be, supposed to be bringing it up for <laughs> Yeah, let's go to sleep for the night. I just made a ton of money on farming. <laughs> Thanks, Redera. Well, I don't think that I need, I don't think I need to step it up just to be flirted with. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's such a thing as, like, relaxing flirting. You know? That's actually kind of nice. Like a Xanax forward. I, you know, honestly, like, there should be more... Z I feel like dating always has to be this like, intense thing where you're like at a bar and you're drinking and there's loud music and like no one can hear what anyone's saying. Like, why can't, what if dating instead of being that was more like Xanax forward? Hey Mary, hey we have a mod. For the first time in the entire stream we have a mod. Uh, that's exciting. Um, Yeah, I feel kind of bad for you, Mary. The chat's the chat's kind of like out of control tonight, so don't stress out too much if if you can't if you can't keep these people in line. 
Like, what I'm saying is, like, what if instead of being this, like, super intense thing, what if dating was, like, more... Like, down a notch, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was in, like, a quiet, relaxing environment where you could have a conversation. And, like, maybe you did less... Like, Xanax forward, you know what I'm saying? Like, you just, like, drank Valerian root tea and, like... Kind of like we're recumbent on various divans and chaise longs. You know what I'm saying? Okay, we don't need a daytime fire. We do need to water the cat's bowl. Uh, I don't know, Ian. I haven't checked in on that in a while, so I don't know if that's happening. At this point, I'm kind of not betting on it. I actually kind of do hate that, like, the, the default expectation for dating is, like, loud bars. You know what I mean? Because it's, like, you can, literally can't engage with someone in that environment except by, like, dancing or, like, shouting half-understood stupid shit at each other. Like, <laughs> it's just, like, not a good setting to, like, actually find out who you're talking to, you know? I guess some people don't care. Some people don't care who they're talking. Like some, like that's not the point. It's about just like you're hot. Let's rub up against each other in a sloppy, loud environment. But that's I don't know. To me, that's like I'm 32 years old. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm not 19. Like I kind of, I kind of like to would get. I would like to get a little bit more out of life and out of dating than that. Yeah, I guess coffee. And coffee shops. Coffee dates, exactly. The thing about coffee is it makes you all like anxious and jittery. It's like, kind of not the ideal date drug in a way. Although it makes you talk, so I guess there's that. Mixed mixed review, mixed feelings about coffee. Okay, we're out of water. Mm. Beach dates? Where do you live where you can go on beach dates? I've never been on a beach date in my life. What does that even involve? Just go to the beach? Hang out? <laughs> Being mysterious at a library. Yeah, see that's... I should, I should maybe try that. I think that is more kind of my vibe. Because part of my problem also, like... I, I don't know if you can tell on stream, but like I have a very soft voice. It doesn't carry well in like loud settings. So no one can hear me. When I make my YouTube videos, I'm actually talking like at my maximum volume. Is this sweet ready? No. Okay, everything's watered. Um, what am I supposed to do with this? Okay, let's get rid of some of this kind of stuff. Uh, oh god, I've got blueberry seeds. Okay. Let's. Yeah, thank you, Oklahoma. No, those are good suggestions. I, I guess I should do, but I like you have to like meet someone. You know what I'm saying? Like you have to meet someone to go on one of those kinds of dates, which I guess means you have to use the apps. Because also part of my problem is that like I do not like no one like no one looks at me and thinks that I'm a gay woman. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like people assume that I'm a straight woman, and. Also, I'm not super assertive with this kind of thing, so... <laughs> Lady, you had me right up until public humiliation. Not sure what that's about. 
But the rest of that sounds great. <laughs> I like that you have a golden yellow couch. Also, I suppose I should say for the record that it's not a great idea to mix alcohol and benzos, but it's never stopped me before. <laughs> Thanks, Andrea. All right, we're gonna we're gonna bring it down a notch without without getting all weird about it. I got a, I got a letter. Okay. I just watered my mailbox. Natalie, I'm gathering data on the correlation between soil al- Okay, bored. Don't care. You need a melon. Okay. So that you can do research on soil? All right. I guess. Thanks, Alfred. I don't live near Trader Joe's, or at least I haven't for a long time, but I used to shop there all the time. Oh, I see, lady. Public humiliation is you, is you simping. Got it. Okay, I'll allow it. That's fine. <laughs> okay, blueberry seeds we're planting. Our final summer crop. I guess I just started saving. No, wait. No, yeah, there's like fall crops, right? It's like winter where there's no crops. The train is passing. Should I go see the train? Is there a reason I should do that? Oh, wait. I need to see the blacksmith and get my geodes opened. I don't think I would look good with an undercut. I don't know. Actually, I usually don't have my nails painted lately. The only reason they're painted now is that I want... It was like a social activity. with some non leses and <laughs> with some bisexuals actually but you know that's why they're painted i have a lot of great lounging couch well i have a, a few great lounging couches I'm kind of thinking about lounging on one now. <laughs> um, what are we doing? I don't know. I, I I've almost given up on a. <laughs> Thanks, Rachel. Favorite vegetable. Uh. Well, okay, it depends, I guess, in what setting. I love green beans, I like broccoli, I do like, um... <laughs> I do like, um... I'm sorry, I just got a text. I do like... A fresh cu- I wish I had a cute, like, cold cucumber slices right now. And I put them on my face and eat half of them. Because I'm really lacking focus here. The train. Abigail. Okay. You're probably not happy with me, Abigail, because there's been a series of gifts that were less than thoughtful. Uh, well, how do you feel about cake? Oh, I already gave her two bad gifts. Okay. I'm just going to run around holding a cake over my head then. Uh, 
all right i'm gonna just walk okay guys this is how you this is how you this is how you <laughs> this is peak pickup artist strategy here you walk into a bar holding a cake over your head this will draw attention to you <laughs> and then you just give it to the bartender i'm glad you're feeling a positive energy about cake emily Uh, who's my spicy person? Is it Leia? Okay, yes. We're doing good. Guys, I, I can feel, I can feel how close, I can feel how close we are to, <laughs> to my crop, of, my creepy crop of sunflowers being ready. Being ready for Haley. <laughs> Gotta, okay, no, oh, it's the blacksmith, the blacksmith is definitely closed. Let's just go to bed. Let me shake some trees. Shake some bushes. Okay, it's almost 2 a.m. here. When it's 2 a.m., I'm going to go to sleep. Because I'm trying not to be like that much of a degenerate i'm trying to like get my life together you know what i'm saying even if the stream is kind of degenerate like i'm here you know what i'm saying like i'm t i'm engaging with an audience it's it's kind of part of my job it's not you know whatever else i would be doing it's not lying on the couch watching darren aronofsky movies and drinking by myself this is what i consider to be progress Stand outside her window playing Peter Gabriel holding the cake like Lloyd Dobler's boombox. Uh, yeah, I feel like that, that that's not the right... It's too much, you know what I'm saying? Look at this massive... I've blown an entire field of sunflowers for Haley. <laughs> it's really a lot. Haley can never know about this. That is an essential part of the strategy. <laughs> strategy is that you cannot tell your crush about the insane field of flowers that you planted for them. Should we check the creepy notebook? Okay, we're doing exactly the same. We have made no progress. <laughs> Oh, it requires scythe. Got it. Oh, I like this part of the music. Okay, great. Um, let's just. Yeah, this is, it's a good song. It's it's. I think that's my favorite summer song. I don't know. The sitar one's good too. Thanks, Wyatt. Have I seen Melancholia? Yes, I have. I think it's 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 my favorite Lars von Trier movie that I've seen. In part because like Kirsten Dunst just carries so much of that movie, and and Charlie Gainsbourg. So much of it is just that they are good. Whereas usually when I'm watching a Lars von Trier movie, I find myself kind of distracted from the movie itself by my feelings of hating Lars von Trier. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's like the predominant emotion that I'm feeling at any given moment is like, wow, I don't like this person. <laughs> the person who made this is irritating me. But Melancholia, I can't feel that as much because, um... Because I'm, uh, you know, there's acting, and the acting's good. Thoughts on Mama, Mama Mia? I've watched that, like, twice while drunk on a plane. 
Somebody's like drunk on a plane movie. That is the most mom behavior imaginable. I remember when I saw, I saw Fifty Shades Read <laughs> with Lindsay Ellis in theaters when it came out. And before that movie, there was like two ads, like two trailers for Mamma Mia, or like the sequel or whatever. And I was like, well, they think that the Fifty Shades audience wants to watch Mamma Mia, Mamma Mia 2. That's how we know that it's for moms. It's 11 a.m. Our crops are watered. We have a day to do things. Okay, focus. Blacksmith, you know? Yeah, I sat in public and watched Fifty Shades of Grey. <laughs> okay, this is not this is not the blacksmith. Join us. Thrive. This is looking blacksmithy. I think I think this is it. Wait, what, Mary? You saw you saw censored Carol. You saw straight Carol on a plane. <laughs> Gal pal Carol. <laughs> that's, that's tragic. Okay, sh no process geodes. So I'm all about processing geodes. Oh, great. Cool. Amazing. Yes, exactly. Oklahoma. Exactly. Ugh. Just coal. Coal and copper. Wait. Ah. Oh, that's petrified slime. Ugh. I don't know if... I don't, I don't think... I don't think anyone wants petrified slime. Wait, isn't Car isn't Carol the original source of the Herald they're lesbians meme? <laughs> it is. So you saw the Herald version of that movie. <laughs> uh. My hair got long, huh? It's almost like too long. I want to catch a butterfly. <laughs> uh, okay, Abigail. Sure. Uh, Chocha Mega Mall. I guess it's the beach. Oh, okay. How do you want? How do you feel about petrified slime? Okay, you don't care. Great. They're heralds, lesbian. Perfect. Okay, what are we? See, I feel like. Let me tell you why I think. So I, I realize that me and Haley seems improbable, but I feel like the way this is gonna work is that the two of us will bond over our shared sense of superiority to the other townspeople. And that's gonna be the, the foundation of this of this whole situation. I would like to be more. No, I just killed a thing. Okay. 
I would like to be more Carol and less notes on a scandal. And I feel like this right here is very notes on a scandal behavior. Okay, so we know Abigail's into flowers, sorry. Well. This is crazy, dude. Like, Im imagine. Imagine keeping an... Like, I need to be sticking little gold stars. Oh. Oh, wait, that, it's okay. F favorites, I see. This was my stage of just giving every woman flowers. Did you know? Okay, when I was in sixth grade, there was this. I feel bad for him in retrospect, but this like awkward kid who like b before valentine's day decided to pass around this piece of paper to the entire class with instructions for every girl in class to write what kind of flower she wanted so that his fucking parents <laughs> could, could send him to school with customized flowers for every girl uh this did not go over well needless to say in fact, I specifically remember writing on that piece of paper, Diamonds, Jeffrey, we want diamonds. At the time, I was a boy. So that's how well this went for Jeffrey. Not good, sweetie. He fucked up. <laughs> Oh, well, his parents clearly were the problem, right? Because we knew parents like, who encouraged this behavior, like... <laughs> Obviously, that's the problem. Oh, it's Vouch. I'm... I'm... I'm winning vouch because I'm always winning. I, I simply can't lose. It's in my genes. And by winning, I mean, I mean this. Okay. Um. I know they should have more single people in the village. I feel like. Well, I guess this wasn't really intended as a dating sim, was it? What am I doing? I'm just like wandering around. I think I just need to sleep. I feel like I had the writer idea when like when I was playing this game a few nights, a few streams ago, and I was just watering my crops and then going to bed at 7 a.m. I feel like let's get back into that vibe. Oh yeah, Vouch, thanks for having me on the thanks for having me on the stream. It was good to be on the stream and congrats on raising what, like six figures for Planned Parenthood, right? It's pretty good. It's super freaking good. Where's my kitty cat? I wanna pet I wanna pet a cat. I wanna virtually pet a cat. That's where I'm at. In terms of my need for for touch. Ow. I'm sleepy. I'm still carrying around my minor salad. I'm sleepy too. Okay. 
Okay, we're running out of summer, guys. Look how rich I am. Oh, and I'm about to get richer because I got all these blueberries. <laughs> Look at them go! <laughs> no, I haven't made a furnace. What am I missing? I need copper or maybe... Okay. I'm really a blueberry farmer. That's become really my main profession. Meow, meow, meow. What if I meow the entire Stardew Valley soundtrack? What I'm doing tomorrow, I also need to edit my like Patreon behind the uh, scenes stuff. There was a point in the video, like behind the scenes, where I attempt to like meow as much of Swan Lake as possible. So I'm not looking forward to going over that. But I obviously need to post it. This tree is getting in the way of my creepy f sunflower farm for Haley. <laughs> That's why I'm afraid it has to go. Okay. This tree also, I'm not loving it. Okay, lady, I won't forget you. All right, I'm gonna, I took a picture on my phone. I'll remember it when I wake up. I'm gonna wake up and I'm gonna text you and I'm gonna tell you to leave your boyfriend. <laughs> because that's the instructions that I've been given. Okay? And this chat is a testament to that. Actually, it's good. It's good to be out of water. Because it means we get to hear that sound. Thanks, Miss Tree. Oh, that tree was your son. I'm sorry. Well, you're trees, so you have more. It's fine. <laughs> I think watering time is everyone's favorite time. It's it's my favorite time for sure. It's incredibly hypnotic. I love that one sitar riff that we just heard, that little, like, pentatonic, like, almost like a blues scale sounding thing. Not enough sitar blues music, in my opinion, in the world, I just mean. Oh, I just remembered to do, I have McDonald's chicken nuggets in the fridge. What's the best way to reheat McDonald's nuggets? I guess the oven? I have nuggies. Okay. I've actually been better about watering my house plants lately. <laughs> Jade, your birthday's in October. My birthday's in October too. That's crazy. Yeah, that's a tweet at me or something. Air fryer? I don't have an air fryer. Should I get one? Or should I order one right now? On, on jojamart.com? <laughs> Okay, not not now. Oh wait, it's 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 time. It's bedtime. It's it's two a.m. Okay, well, let's um, just how do you save? Do you just exit game or do you just sleep? I don't know how this game works. Thank you. 
Thanks, Kevin. You too. Do I even have copper for a furnace yet? Alright, I need to buy an air fryer. Clearly. Okay, sleep to save. Okay, is everything watered? If everything's watered, I'm just gonna be a depression farmer. I love to be a depression farmer. I just go to sleep. Oh my god, sunflowers take a long time. It's gonna be worth it though. It's gonna be worth it for Haley. OVXX, Ryan, uh, you here. Okay, I need to learn how to air fry things, clearly. Uh, thanks, Trash. <laughs> thanks, Trash. I have seen your clips, yes. Um, thanks, Alfred. I do like Lana Del Rey, yes. I actually... I actually, like, summer of 2019, like, when the real depression started, I was doing a lot of, like, sad girl listening to Lana Del Rey. This was also... I was, like, so committed to heterosexuality. I, that's, like, a very, like sad straight girl activity i was able to serve straight girls so convincingly <laughs> that's how convincing it was it was even convincing when i was crying alone listening to lana de Rey. okay i think it's time to uh it was straight okay it's, it's 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 time to be striking yes exit to yes okay what was striking was that there were no mods in the stream. And considering that there were no mods, I would say that that actually went better than I was expecting. <laughs> it was a little unruly, it was a little wild, but it, like considering the fact that we, we went like a solid 90 minutes without one mod chatting, I'm surprised that did not go worse. <laughs> anyway, on that note, this was weird. Let's uh let's get some rest and you know what? We're gonna try we're all gonna try again tomorrow. That's all you can do. Good night. A good night. Eh. Eh oui. <laughs>